All right, all right, all right, family. Now we're going to go ahead and open up the Good Pods app. Okay. And now we, I want to highlight a few things. So across the top, you see it says podcast, then it says people, and then it says groups. Okay. So what I want to just walk through really quick and talk through really quick now is just the layout. So that up top, letting us know that just below, we can search for whatever podcast we desire. So let's say I go down in the podcast search column and I type in your podcast mentor. And then look, I'm highlighted. I click it and boom, my podcast is the first podcast to pop up. We'll click the X. Then we're going to go to people right across the top once again. And then down below, you see it says invite your friends. So you can invite your contacts. You can invite friends from Facebook. You can invite friends from Twitter. And then you can just overall share the Good Pods app. I really love the shareability feature within the platform because one thing that I think is really, really neat is the simple fact that it allows me to basically do it with one click, one share to share the app and get more friends on the platform. Okay, then the far right at the top, it says groups. And then Good Pods recommends some groups. So they're recommending groups around mental health. They're recommend, rep, recommending groups on gardening podcasts and different things like that. And then also we can go down below and we can see, you know, what groups has the most members. So the astrology group, the indie podcast group, uh, hosted by podcast father, and then the podcast group. But then just below there's what? most active groups so podcast father uh the group pod nation the other podcast group so i love how they allow you to find and connect with other people in groups on the platform so now let, let's let's take it a step further so i'm going to go now to the bottom far left hand corner of the application we're going to click it where it says feed you see how they have it broken down across the top it says following it says everyone, and then it says groups. So based on the people that I'm following, if I click the following tab, it's going to show the podcast that I've listened to last based on the people that I'm following, right? So this is me, and that's Ken from the Good Pods team. That's Crystal Prophet, and that's Sam Peebles, okay? So that that's, I mean, that's really amazing. So that that's a feature, and then we have the everyone, and I personally appreciate this feature a lot because if we scroll down, it lets us see what everyone on the platform is currently listening to. So this was a way that I was introduced to a few new shows based on not knowing to even look for some of these shows, right? So I can scroll down, I can see that Austin N is listening to the gaming history, talking a little bit about a little bit about Xbox. And then I can see game for a movie a zombie, right? So just scrolling down, these are other podcasts that other people are listening to. And then the groups, and I broke down the groups a little bit earlier, but this now is sharing the podcast that people are listening to based on if I'm in those groups. So I'm in the Indie Podcast Father group. I'm in the Pod Nation group. And you can see the people who are sharing their listens or they're sharing the podcast that they're currently listening to just below it it says the name of the group that they dropped it in okay so that's another feature i really love about good pods is the fact that they allow you the opportunity to share your podcast within groups of other podcasters but then it's also getting shared in groups with people who are avid podcast listeners. So this increases your brand awareness. This also increases your discoverability. So now we're gonna go one step further and I'm gonna click the icon at the very bottom, just to the left, it says library. This is the second icon at the bottom. And then it asked me, do I wanna continue listening to the Premier Boys podcast, right? Because at the top it says, continue listening. The next selection below says my downloads. And then the third section says latest episodes. So let me break it down really quick. So continue listening lets us know that we started listening to this episode, but we haven't finished it just yet. 
and there's the th there's the progress bar that's inside the tab for each of those episodes if he hasn't finished them so you see the premier boys podcast i haven't finished that episode we have all the smoke with cam newton didn't completely finish that we have comedy gold mines with kevin hart and he was interviewing amanda seals so one thing i want to point out is the progress bar notifies you so maybe you're listening to a podcast and then you're like oh i gotta go do this or i gotta go do that now it allows you to it, it basically is helping you remember to go back and finish listening to the podcast okay so i pulled down to refresh then it says my downloads i have the how i built this talking about uncle nearest i have the on purpose podcast with gabrielle union greatest minds these are other podcasts that i've downloaded so i'll click the view all beside the my downloads i'll click the view all and these are um a lot of podcasts that i have downloaded so comedy gold mines we see i have four episodes we also see that i have the how i got into coaching with uh, cliff ravenscraft so these are podcasts that i've downloaded because i've said i want to go back and listen to those and those are podcasts that I don't want to pass up. Okay, so we're going to go back. And we're going to scroll down a little bit more. And now this tab says latest episodes, latest episodes. What is latest episodes? If you subscribe to a podcast on the Good Pods platform, then it will refresh and let you know when a new episode drops. So the Social Proof Podcast just dropped this episode. Yesterday's price is not today's price. So let's say we want to click on that podcast by David Shands. So one thing that we see is it tells me play the episode. So I can go ahead and play the episode. And then after I play it, it gives me the opportunity to rate the episode. So you can rate individual episodes. And then I even could come in and comment and say, I love the perspective that Dave brings i also can appreciate the perspective that donnie shares as well so we'll say that's going to be the comment that we want to share and then i can just click post to the far right i'll just click it post and now look down at the bottom it shows that I've commented on this particular episode. So the thing I want to underscore here is on each episode, it has its own comment thread or just as we would think about with Facebook, when you would update your status, I, I like to call this like a podcast status. So we're commenting on a podcast status, if you will. That's what I like to personally call it. I don't think good pods calls it that. So we'll go back once again, then they have the search column down at the bottom where we can click search then up at the top i can search groups right because you see groups is highlighted i can pick people and i can search people i can go podcast i can search podcast okay so just want to highlight that then we scroll down it says just for you on the podcast those are podcasts they recommend based on what i've listened to then we have this week your friends listen to and then they have other podcast episodes that the people that i'm following are listening to down here a little bit further they have a featured list they have a featured curated list of different podcasts that are similar or like-minded topics so to the far left they have the best podcast this is from the new york times i believe this is the best podcast of 2020 then they have the entrepreneur, the entrepreneurs must listen uh, by blog her. Then they have best podcast 2021 that's hosted by Vulture. Tribeca Podcast Fest. The list goes on and on for what they would recommend, but it's a featured list. So you can just scroll down, scroll down. Best history podcast, best parenting podcast, best environmental podcast, best music podcast. As you all know, there is podcast for everything under the sun. And then we can scroll down a little bit further. And then there's Good Pods Top 100 Shows. So they have that category. 
where it's just the top 100. I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory. And then we can go down a little bit further. And then there's top 100 shows by category. So they have the arts category, they have the business category, comedy, education, fiction, government, history, health and fitness, kids and family, leisure, music, news, religion, spirituality, it goes on and on. And then down a little bit further, it says Good Pods Top 100 Episodes. So this lays out the episodes that are most popular. So if you want to know what people are listening to across the globe that's most popular on the Good Pods app, then you can go here and listen. You can see The Great Supply Chain Disruption by The Daily Podcast. You can listen to 35, aka Hot Battle Bacon <laughs> by The Drunken Theory Podcast. So there are those options. And then there is the Good Pods Recommends. So Good Pods Recommends is basically a list of podcasts that the Good Pods team has come together and they share the recommendations. They listen, they vote, and then they determine what podcast should get spotlighted for the Good Pods Recommends, okay? Down at the bottom, it says people in the know. So Good Pods is a great hub for anybody who is a podcaster or an avid podcast listener to where you can go and it's all under your fingertips to where, like I said before, you have the opportunity to not only hear a podcast, but follow people and connect with them. So now your listeners have a face. Now your listeners have a name. And now you can thank them for listening to your show. And you can also create conversation around episodes, which I think is really, really powerful, all within the same app. And then down at the very bottom, it says podcast by category, right? They got it broken up, arts and culture, business and economics, comedy, then crime, and then education, all right? We'll just click on education to see what we got. Loading podcasts, okay, education, all right? We'll scroll down a little bit, education, pretty neat, pretty neat. We'll go back. And then now I wanna hit on the alerts. So let's push the alert button. So it gives you the option to turn on your notifications, right? You can turn on your notifications on the top far right where it says turn on alerts. You can click latest episodes to see the latest episodes that people have released on their platforms, right? Just like I said earlier, yesterday's price is not today's price, Dave and Donnie. That was the episode that was released today. The same with the Netflix is a daily joke. So that episode was released today. And just as you all heard me share earlier about chartable sales sheets, that episode was released today as well by Podcast News, okay? And then shout out to my client, Breezy Banks, right there down at the bottom, the SPE story time. So she talks about the story of her son. And if you have not checked out her podcast, check out the Fearless Faith podcast with Breezy Banks. Strong, strong episode. Okay, now we're going to hit back. Then I'm going to show you latest group activity. We'll click that one. And then as I was sharing with you before about the names of the different groups, this is a great opportunity for you just to see. All, these are the groups that I'm a part of. And every time somebody posts in the group, you'll be able to see who shared in the group. And then based on them sharing in the group, we'll just click right here on Podcast Father. Based on Brett and Tony with Ash and Abe sharing in the group, now I can go in and I can like the post or I can click the comment if I want to comment on the post and then I can click share episode if I want to share with a friend. Let's just click share. See, they give me this amazing amount of options where I can post on my feed. I can post in a group. I can directly share with a friend. I can copy the link. I can share Instagram stories. I can go all down the line of what I desire to do right there. So we'll close that out. And last but not least, I'll just hit on the profile. The profile right here, what the profile is, is it lets people know what my podcasts are. I have Beyond the Ball podcast with Jonathan Jones, and I have Your Podcast Mentor with Jonathan Jones. Then I describe what I do, say, got podcasts, learn how to start, launch, and monetize your podcast down below. So ultimately, what I want to say about Good Pods is it's a phenomenal platform 
for you to be able to connect with people and have organic conversation about your show, about their show, and begin to build relationship. So that wraps it up for this Good Pods tutorial. Just wanted to let you all in behind the curtain so you get an opportunity to see what I see. And I would encourage you, I would encourage you, I would strongly encourage you to download the Good Pods app. All right, download it on the Apple iOS store or in the Google Play store. Because if you're a podcaster, you want to have this app because this app has single-handedly shifted me from listening on Spotify and listening on Apple to come over and listen on Good Pods. So what does that tell you? But all right, my friends, it's your podcast mentor, Jonathan Jones. That wraps up this tutorial.